from Tampa Bay Streaming News Leader. This is ABC Action News. Hello, I'm Lauren St. Germain. Chief Meteorologist Dennis Phillips has Florida's most accurate forecast in just a moment, but first your top stories at this hour. 42 million Americans are expected to take a road trip 50 miles or longer this holiday weekend. Traffic experts say travel times could double for some drivers. Here in the Bay Area, you need to remember to stay alert as you're driving because we're now learning 2021 was one of the deadliest years to be on the roads in our area. Medical experts are trying to figure out the source of a listeria outbreak that has a link to Florida. Florida. At least 23 people have gotten sick. One person even died from the virus. Five pregnant women got it and one had a miscarriage. The CDC says most of the people who got sick either traveled to or lived in Florida shortly before symptoms started. Food contamination is a major source, but not always easy to see. The food might not look or smell spoiled. A new law will allow local governments to ban smoking on Florida beaches. State Senator Joe Gruder says the law will make beaches safer and more attractive to visitors. And Environmental groups say cigarette butts are one of the top trash items found on Florida beaches, harming the environment and wildlife. Now here's Chief Meteorologist Dennis Phillips with Florida's most accurate forecast. Dennis. How you doing everybody? Skies are partly cloudy with storms winding down through the evening. I think the forecast stays exactly the same on Saturday, on Sunday, and on the 4th of July. So let's go ahead and time it out for you. First half of the day on Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, dry. Lunchtime. Between noon and two, there will be storms developing along the coast. Some could be a little bit heavy. We had some hail Friday afternoon in areas around holiday from these storms. And then they move inland through the afternoon and evening. Eventually, whatever's out there kind of back builds toward the beach in the early evening. That is Saturday, that is Sunday, and that's also the fourth. So there will be scattered periods of storms. There will be sun. There will be a little bit of everything. Most of the rain will be over, though, by 9 or 9.30 for the firework display. So let's keep our fingers crossed for that. Southeast winds for the boaters, 5 to 10 knots, locally heavy in those storms. Water temperature, 90 degrees. Your sunrise, Saturday morning, 6.38, sunset, 8.31. The beach, again, partly to mostly sunny in the morning. Late morning, early afternoon, some showers and storms and then partly sunny the rest of the day. Florida's most accurate seven day forecast. Highs, low 90s, rain coverage pretty solid at 50 to 70% right through the holiday weekend.